Hey guys, it's Rob again. Uh, this time I'm doing a review on the Tobacco Turtle Ship uh, version 2 clone. Um, I did receive from them uh, about three or four weeks ago. Uh, this is what it came in. Full box here. It's got the, got a ship on there and that's in Korean or whatever, I don't know. <laughs> um, but uh, obviously it's the, a clone of the Korean mod. Uh, the turtle ship. Uh, there's their branding on it. It's really pretty nice. Uh, it was sealed. Kind of hard to get out, but uh, I did achieve it. Getting this, this damn thing off here. But uh, here it is. There we go. Got that foam insert in there, just like on the, the Hades. And here it is. Here's the tobacco version of it. Does have the logos on it? It's upside down. <laughs> there you go. It does have the ship on the back, the turtle ship. Uh, I don't remember what that that means. It's something about with one swing of a sword or you know, blood and mountains and stuff. I don't know. I didn't look it up, but um, that's what it looks like right there. That's how it came. Uh, it's stainless stainless steel, it's brushed stainless steel. It does have the kick? I guess the kick ring on it right there in the middle this section here. Uh, when I did get it, it, the threads were a little crunchy. Uh, they were a little dirty. Uh, not too dirty, but just like this one. I haven't used it with kick, but it's real... I don't know if you can hear that. Yeah. It was real hard to get off, but I'm not going to use it anyway, so I don't use a kick. But uh, Get this back on here. Kind of squeaky. Squeaky dreads, but um, performance-wise, it's worked. <laughs> it hits pretty freaking hard. I was really surprised. I had a heck of a time uh, getting this thing to work right because uh, I wasn't familiar with this mod at all. So uh, I messed with it. We messed with it for a good day, just trying to figure it out, and I got it. So uh, it is. I have it in six, uh, 18650 mode right now. Uh, it's got the locking ring on it right now, which is a uh, if you screw that on kind of tight, it's a pain in the butt to, un to uh, unscrew. But uh switch is really, really nice. Very, very nice. Doesn't matter where you, where you hit that switch, it's going to fire. Um, top cap, I've kind of scratched a little bit. If you can see it. I don't know. You can see it, probably. But um, everything you put on here, it, it works pretty well. It's got a floating pin in there, so... Um, it does make a kind of a pain in the butt to put different atomizers and then you gotta you gotta adjust it completely uh, here's the Patriot clone from Tobacco as well and you just screw it on and then push it down push it down where it makes a connection silver plated contact on the top and on the bottom um, get this back on here and uh, got juice everywhere as always as we all do, take out this bottom cap. It's got this uh, white plastic insulator, I guess, uh, that screws and unscrews depending on your battery. And it's got that silver plated uh, bottom connector there for your, your battery. It does have some venting there in the bottom, so it'll vent outside the switch. Uh, I have a, a Sony uh, VTC4, I think it is. Put it in there. There you go. And it fires. <laughs> I had a heck of a time because since, like I said, I didn't know how, how this worked very well, this mod. Uh, I had a lot of battery rattle. Uh, so you got to adjust, you know, your top um, <clears throat> your top pin. And then I'd have a gap at the bottom or a gap at the top. So you got to unscrew the bottom cap and then mess with this piece, screwing it up or down. And then, and uh, yeah, so it wasn't, it wasn't that much. It wasn't that much of a pain. I just didn't know how to do it, but uh, once you get it, it's pretty easy. Um, see, I got a little bit, a little bit of battery rattle, so just because I moved it, so just unscrew this a little bit. Come on, get on there. There we go. More. <laughs> screw this a little more. 
And this will probably do it. Yeah, there you go. And it fires. But it hits very well. That juice in my mouth. <laughs> but uh, I mean, the first time I put something on there, it just boom! It just hit me, hit me hard. So uh, no problems with with connectivity. Uh, put something else on here. Here's my atomic. See, and then right away, there you go. You're gonna have to adjust. See, I'm gonna have to adjust that now. It's gonna fire, but it's not gonna sit flush until I uh, move the battery back down a little bit. But uh, like I said, it just I think it hits. I think it hits better than the Hades. It's just boom every time. It's just freaking amazing. Um, let me see. I get grab the K fun again here. Stick it on there. 22 millimeter. So everything you have that's 22 millimeter. Well, nice and flush. That's firing too. But it got that gap there. See that gap. Uh, it's gonna hit it's gonna hit hard but I did get this from tobacco um, I got it free I didn't pay for it um, but uh, that's that's pretty much it with this with this mod it's pretty simple straightforward it's uh, nice and small it's uh, a little I guess a little bit bigger than a nemesis um, I got big hands so it fits in there pretty nice but uh, I really like it you know I like it because it's you know, I can stick it in my pocket and and uh, not worry about it. Uh, that you know, like the Hades or something that's huge and it it's in my pocket and it's just you know it weights you down. But uh, it's a nice mod to have um, to work to take to work or whatever. Um, uh, no problems with it whatsoever. Uh, that's really much it. Um, there's really nothing else I could talk about. Um, yeah. It's just really nice. Uh, there's pretty much everybody selling this now. Um, 101 Vapes does have it on their website. Um, I think it's $29 or $25, $29. Not that expensive. It's pretty cheap. Uh, once you, you know, when, like I said, once you get it, learn how to use it and how to adjust it. It's it's going to perform very well. Um, I want to see how long it holds up the silver plated uh, plating on the contacts. See how long that'll hold up, but. Uh, for the most part, so far, I haven't had any scratches on those posts or nothing, so um, it should be working pretty well for a while. Um, that's that's it, yeah. Take another hit, call it up. Yeah, that's pretty good. Um, uh, just starting these reviews up, uh, like I said in my last video for the Hades. Um, uh, I'm sure I'll get better at this, but... Uh, I'm just starting out, so uh, take it easy on me. <laughs> and, um, thanks again, Tobacco, for sending these products out to me. Um, you know, those people that hate clones, um, don't buy it. <laughs> Turtle Ships, a little more affordable um, if you have the budget, you know, if you budget it out. But um, for me, you know, I buy lots of clones. I have other clones, too, that I have purchased, and um, I enjoy them just as much as uh, some of the higher end stuff that I've have that I've bought and um, you know I don't really care you know if I can't afford it then might as well I'll step down a little bit you know in quality or um, just for the name or whatever but uh, that's all I got for you guys um, take it easy I will see you again soon